What's up, guys? This is KG48. Uh, sorry, what's up, Zombie Slayers? This is KG48. Welcome back to Subserver. We are live on Twitch, and it's going on Cagecast Live. And uh, we're getting ready for Horde Night now. We're getting excited because it's going to be boring and underwhelming. Um, but still, you know, it's okay. I want to do some building. I'm not really in the mood to fight a Horde right now anyway. I think next time uh, we play, I'm gonna we're going to get the jar thing going. Try and make some money at the trader. I'm going to take secret stash see what we can do. Okay. Right back to base. Right, can we pick this up? Ah, uh, sure we can. Nope, 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 nope. There we go. All right, let's get up top. Oh, we don't even have spikes on this side. Oh well, <laughs> whatever. Yeah, we got spikes also. We got spikes to put around too. Somebody's gonna put them around. Yeah, it's getting close to the horde night. <laughs> Uh, I don't have a hammer on me. That's just wonderful. Trying to see where they went to. They weren't here. I, I got them. I got em. Oh, okay. Uh, no tools, tools, tools. Okay. Uh, if you took all the spikes, split them with me, Cage. I'm right behind you. I'll. Drop an upgrade too. Okay. Did you follow me out the door? Yep. There you go. There's not much more to do, but. Actually, I think that's it. I'm going to elongate this entrance a couple mm -hmm. spikes just to, yeah. All right, let's make a few more wood frames. Hey Shade, I don't know if you can hear me, but you might want to back up. I'm planning on collapsing what's above you. Thank you. One done help? Oh no, I'm good. Okay. Let's do science. Here we go. How many chance you could make me a uh, bow? Oh, Pam, you should probably turn off your forges for Horde Night. That might make this Horde exciting, though. I hate screamers. I like excitement, <laughs> but I hate screamers. They just drive me nuts with their stupid, big, freaking stupid screamer mouths. just want to punch them. <clears throat> I hate him. I hate him as much as I hate the uh, the mutants in uh, in the forest. Where do Pam live? Behind that door. Yeah. You guys know we're on Horde Night and they're going to be able to get to you pretty easily. I don't know if you guys know that. Mm -hmm. Okay. But you keep saying they're not a big deal, so... No, oh, okay. I mean, they're not a big deal if you're in your base, but... <laughs> I mean, being out there with them, I don't know if the... 
best idea, but eh, I'm safe. I'm, I mean, I'm on the patio. I'm not really out there with them. No, I was talking to the other people. Oh, uh-huh. Nobody put lights up. I can't oh, we can't even make the concrete. That's right, because we need the um, concrete mixer. I forgot about that. Oh, you I have got it. it. I, I have to make the concrete. Oh, okay. All right, cool. I? That's what you meant. Okay, good. I've got the mix. Do I have to make the blocks for you? No, no, it's fine. So, yes, this is your place, Pam. I see. Um... Okay, so I made this. I made the cement mix. Uh, do I need to make the concrete no, you're blocks good. too? You're good. Okay. It's really hard to. Yeah, I, I don't even. I can't hit these guys. I can't even see them, it's so dark uh, now. They're, they're running in underneath the patio. Yeah, we weren't really prepared for this. We're prepared, we're gonna be fine. It's just, uh, the way they bounce around those spikes, it just irritates me. Mm -hmm. I don't even want to bother. the door open cave. Oh, that's Bambi. I'm so sorry. Oh, okay. I just grabbed a coffee and I'm going out with my sledgehammer. We're gonna have to redo that porch. We're probably gonna have to take the whole thing down. Yeah, I think so. Don't walk over these uh, wood frames, okay? Okay. Like you just did. <laughs> well, I started to walk over before you said don't. Alright, well, don't anymore because I'm gonna put some uh, stuff down. You don't need to drink. I believe in you. <laughs> I wouldn't care, but um, the sound the uh, the character makes is really irritating. Plus, uh, people will yell at me. Uh, basically, I think a zombie could walk right up here and get in, Kate. Where? I'm here on the one on the step. Here on the step, it walk. really doesn't tell me much. Here, here, come, come in the door, by the, right here. Turn around, yeah. turn around, come up here. Do do do. I can't, I can't get out there because you're in the way. Um, no, they can't. Well, I guess they could. It'd be difficult for them, but I'll take care of it right now. Oh, I see, I see, I see. Okay. Yeah, now they're blocked. With Actually, I'll put down. that back.
What do we got there? Uh, Coop Dog, thank you very much for the, uh... Thank you very much for the for the bits. I'm trying to figure out what exclamation point eat means in the wrong stream. I'm not sure if that was a joke or... <laughs> You're not leaving many kills for other people, Bambi. Why you so leap, Bambi? Oh. I'm sorry, I figured I'd run out here with my sledgehammer. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> Trust me, the way Get these them, zombies Bambi. are, they're going straight for the building. They aren't touching me. Get them, Bambi. The, 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 um, another problem with multiplayer is the zombies are completely stupid. Um, when we were on our last world that I was try I was hoping would be fixed here. Um, when I was at their mailing, yeah, they would ignore me and go right for the building. It was so annoying. So I thank all of you for drawing their attention. That way I can sneak attack and you know go full stealth <laughs> with the sledgehammer. Got a dog on you? Yeah, and he turned immediately. Pretty set up here. Uh, Zoni, thank you very much for the bits. Oh, you're the bit boss, brah. Nice job. The railing's in the way now. Yeah, you can shoot through it. That's why I use that instead of the. Yeah, I just can't see through it to aim, though. Oh, that's your problem. I got no problem with it. Get good. No, it's just that where the zombies are coming from this time is right in the path of that top bar. So you have to wait for them to get closer to the house to shoot them. All right. They're, they're stabbing each other. It looked like they were stabbing each other. Pixel plane, whoever that other person was. Go and get something to eat. Yes, that's right, Crusher. I will eat. Sweet. Another treasure map. A lot of people upset over the new stripper. Why? Because, like, because of boobs and stuff, or, like, Yeah, it was a little jarring for me. I mean, I'm not gonna say I was upset about it. Like, it didn't, you know, it didn't bother me. Like, but it was it was jarring. It was it was um, it was a little weird. Um, it's sa same way it w I felt it was weird when I when I played um, uh, what do you call it? Um, Grand Theft Auto Five, and like you go to strip club and they get topless. Yeah, you know, it's just it's just weird. I don't know. I'm not sure if it's because it's a video game character or just because it's breasts. I really don't know, but it was. It was a little bit, um, it was a little bit jarring. Now I'm, you know, I'm used to it. I was never upset about it.
<laughs> Stripper Bob. Stripped Bobs. <laughs> I don't want to watch a stripper named Bob. So, just putting that out there. Hey Pam, do you want me to just scrap brass items or try to keep them whole so you can throw them in the forge? Try to keep them whole if you can. If you have to scrap them to bring them back, that's fine. Oh no, it's fine. I'm just, I'm right here. Cage, can I grab a chassis now for that um, battery I gave you earlier? I I uh, set him up in uh, Pam's forge. I don't know if she took him out. Yeah, or... I put him. Yeah, I put him in the resources box. It should be. All right, I just didn't want to start helping myself. You need yeah, the other stuff too, though. So. I literally only need I need the seat, handlebars, and battery. Yeah. Which, <laughs> seat and handlebars. Um, I'll get you the resources for those. Okay. I'm just trying to keep my stuff where I want it. Anyone by chance have some honey? Um, I got some antibiotics I'll pass to you, I think. That would be great. Never mind, I don't. Oh, Sorry. got Just my wait hopes up. Antibiotic teas. Just wait till you die in the first time, then it'll be over. But like, what if I don't wanna die? The dying isn't the hard part, it's being out of freaking stamina for three days. Yeah. Irritating. Uh. Obsidian, I think, is talking to you. I think he said yes. Sir. Give me more iron bars, Pam. Okay, dork. Well, the forges are off at the moment. Oh, you can turn it back on. Yes, I can turn it back on. Yeah, it's over. Some more iron cage. Yeah, I put a bunch of your resource thing. Oh, uh, in the resources? Okay. I put 400 in there. Did you already melt them? Yeah. Or... I'm well on, the way to, well on the way to having melted it. Do you put points into um, quicker crafting pen? Oh, yeah. Okay, that's what I thought, because you, you get that shit really quick. Quicker crafting and miscellaneous crafting, because both of them speed you up. Yeah, I do miscellaneous crafting, but I don't do... Uh, I don't usually do quicker crafting just because. Yeah, I do quicker crafting. Yeah, I mean, I, I don't it mind. It makes a difference. In multiplayer, it's cool because we could like share tasks, but in single player, right, I gotta right. be careful with my points. Oh yeah, if I didn't put in a quicker quicker crafting, I'd go nuts waiting on stuff to get done. Yeah, but like, well, you play really differently than we do, though. Like, we'll go out and do mm -hmm. stuff. You're just like in the room staring at the thing, so <laughs> I could see that. Getting on your nerves. I think she means it's just gonna be you. Where's my pickaxes, Pam? But I mean, you get something like iron bars, which God take freaking forever. If somebody didn't have, if you didn't have quicker crafting and miscellaneous crafting, I mean, well, like it's I said, take I, a long time even with those two I, things going. I do okay in single player, but that's because like when it's all cooking up, I'm doing other things. So. Mm -hmm. Oh. 
Well, this side of the house is all done. Okay, the bars. I've got some forged iron coming out as soon as that's out. You can have your bar. Oh, that's right. It's gonna be for your action. It's gonna be for next oh, time, okay. anyway. So. Okay. Yeah, this, um, this, uh, I don't know what we're going to do about this, uh, porch. Uh huh? You don't know what you're going to do about what? I don't think we could do anything with the porch because I think he built above it. I'd like to, like, take down the porch oh. and move it up. I'm not above the porch at all. I actually I am right at the cutoff. Okay. Can't, can't we do like we did in the other house and take out... Um, the center wood blocks and put. We could, but the, um, the porch is pretty. Bars in. The porch is pretty close. Well, actually, there's nothing to shoot down underneath. I don't know if you noticed, but there's a wall over here. This is where the porch ends. Oh, you don't have to shoot underneath the porch. No, and I'd actually, I want to move it up because it's really close to the bottom. Okay. And then, but that's for next time. What about putting a stairwell down in the porch and then putting the um, the poles in front of the spikes? We can melee and stuff through them. Yeah, if you want, we could do that. I don't really care what this base is, just uh, just temporary until we get to, you know, start making the real base. Build on the big base. Yeah, I, I even hate wasting things like expensive iron bars to, on this base because it's so temporary. Yeah, but it's not going to be that temporary. The other base is not going to be ready for any, like, I'm thinking like day 42. Like, honestly, it's going to take that mm -hmm. long. Um, okay. I need to, I want to make like a, a hexagon. Or, is it hexagon? The pentagon is, that's, that's, uh... Five sides. That's five, yeah. Okay, so that one, okay. Maybe a, what, hexagon six or or eight? I, honestly, I don't know. Six. Octagon is eight. Okay, so hexagon six, right? Yeah. I kind of wanted to make a six-sided one, so. And then, like, but I'm not sure what I want to do, though. I do want, I was thinking, like, all right, so I was thinking the hexagon uh, on the, this, the, the, the ramp parts, you know, like the slope parts, that'll be solid right. wall. But I'm thinking the blocks that are, are that are you know, 90 degree angle blocks, I think those we should put iron bars in there. And I think we should also put a door in there. I would like iron bars and like a door and then like a little walkway and then another door and then another walkway and another, like multiple doors that they would have to break through. But stuff we could shoot at them through the iron bars. Iron bars aren't that strong, but we don't need it to be that strong because if if they get too if they get too close to the metal, we could just back off into the bunkers, which would go underground, and then we'd have bunkers surrounding the building. That was kind of what I was thinking about. I think six is pretty good. <sighs> I was thinking we could also make use of uh, dart traps. I was thinking like one dart trap over each doorway. Could be pretty cool. Oh yeah, jail doors. Uh, what are the dimensions on the jail doors? Three blocks. Okay. Wide. See, that would be tough to defend. Because, well, I mean, three? I, I, yeah, we could do that. Yeah. Yeah. And then we can make three wide hallways. Like once they walk in, if they break in that one door, we have a three lane hallway going to the side and we can have iron bars on both sides. We can just destroy them as they're going through the hallway. Um, yeah. Yeah, we could even have shotgun turrets lined up there. Yeah, okay. Okay, I think I got some ideas. It's gonna have to be a really big building though. Like really freaking big. All right, let me find someone to uh, to raid, and then we will jet. Uh, well, I guess I should uh, end the recording, because I, for I forgot I was recording. All right, guys, that's going to be it for this video. <laughs> we'll see you next time. Till then, take it easy. What's up, guys? This is KG48. Uh, sorry, what's up, Zombie Slayers? This is KG48. Welcome back to Subserver. We are live on Twitch, and it's going on Cagecast Live. And uh, we're getting ready for Horde Night now. We're getting excited because it's going to be boring and underwhelming. Um, but still, you know, it's okay. I want to do some building. I'm not really in the mood to fight a Horde right now anyway.
I think next time uh, we play, I'm gonna we're gonna get the jar thing going. Try and make some money at the trader. I'm gonna take secret stash. See what we can do. Okay. All right, back to base. All right, can we pick this up? Ah, uh, sure we can. Nope, 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 there we go. Alright, let's get up top. Oh, we don't even have spikes on this side. Oh well, <laughs> whatever. Yeah, we got spikes on, so we got spikes to put around too, so we gonna put them around. Yeah, it's getting close to the coordinate. Uh, I don't have a hammer on me. It's just wonderful. Trying to see where they went to. They were here, I, I got saw them. I got them. Oh, okay. Uh, no, tools, tools, tools. Okay. Uh, if you took all the spikes, split them with me, Cage. I'm right behind you. I'll drop and upgrade them, too. Okay. Did you follow me out the door? Yep. There you go. There's not much more to do, but... Actually, I think that's it. I'm gonna elongate this entrance a couple mm -hmm. spikes just to. Yeah. All right, let's make a few more wood frames. Shade, I don't know if you can hear me, but you might want to back up. I'm planning on collapsing what's above you. Thank you. One done hill? Oh, no, I'm good. Okay. Let's do science. There we go. How many chance you could make me a uh, bow? Oh, Pam, oh. you should probably turn off your forges for Horde Night. That might make this Horde exciting, though. I hate screamers. I like excitement, but I hate screamers. They just drive me nuts with their stupid, big, freaking stupid screamer mouth. Just want to punch them. <clears throat> I hate him. I hate him as much as I hate the uh, the mutants in uh, in the forest. Where do Pam live? Behind that door? Yeah. You guys know we're on Horde Night and they're gonna be able to get to you pretty easily. I don't know if you guys know that. Mm -hmm. Okay. But you keep saying they're not a big deal, so. No, okay. I mean, they're not a big deal if you're in your base, but. <laughs> I mean, being out there with them, I don't know if it's the best idea, but. Eh, I'm safe. <laughs> I'm, I mean, I'm on the patio. I'm not really out there with them. No, I was talking to the other people. Oh, uh -huh. Nobody put lights up. I can't oh, we can't even thing. make the concrete. That's right, because we need the, um, 
concrete mixer. I forgot about that. Oh, you I have got it. it. I, I have to make the concrete. Oh, okay. All right, cool. I? That's what you meant. Okay, good. I've got the mix. Do I have to make the blocks for you? No, no, it's fine. So, yes, this is your place, Pam. I see. Um... Okay, so I made this. I made the cement mix. Now, do I need to make the concrete no, you're blocks good. too? You're good. Okay. It's really hard to. Yeah, I, I, don't even, I can't hit these guys. Can't even see him. It's so dark. Now they're they're running in underneath the patio. Yeah, we weren't really prepared for this. We're prepared. We're gonna be fine. It's just uh, the way they bounce around those spikes. It just irritates me. Mm -hmm. I don't even want to bother. the door open cave. Oh, that's Bambi. I'm so sorry. Oh, okay. I just grabbed a coffee and I'm going out with my sledgehammer. <laughs> 